Hello, hi, I'm Christian Ngeku Tahabit and this is Project Grove. Now, Project Grove is a first-person puzzle platformer in which you play a legendary alchemist who's trying to save the world by curing it of the great rot. Now, what I'm playing right now is a demo version. The game is not finished yet, it's in development and it's also on Kickstarter because its developers, Antler Studios, is trying to raise funds to finish the title. Now, let's check out Project Grove together. The engineer pins have left a service analysis for you. It will inform you about the immediate area. 1EP1N has left a sample from a new flora they located. Marvellous. Would you kindly show me to that service analysis? Yeah, we're very... Uh, <laughs> we're uh, very cyberpunky. Kinda. So, st steampunky, not cyberpunky. <laughs> steampunky in our look. Uh, okay. Elpin, where are you? Where, where are you going? Hmm, that looks pretty bad. But this place is luscious. All right. Okay. 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 Wait. 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 I'm coming. What do we have? What's this? Hmm. Use the saxophone. reports possible magical readings. Let's go take a look. All right. Come on. Saxophone. Ah, look at this. The wonderful world of, uh, well, the forest of Dakrima. This is the peninsula where we live. Huh, shiny. Very shiny. Edric, you have a saxophone message from Potentium. Okay, I'll go there. Chillax. Okay. This does not look very safe, but okay. What the hell? Is this where I make. I don't know, my experiments, I clone people or animals. Okay, let's see. Message time. Greetings from Potentium HQ, Mr. Tate. What a pleasure it is to be working with you. Let me introduce myself. I am Lorna Casely from Human Resources. Mm. But, you know, I think of it more as humans relating. Right. Uh, because that's what HR is really all about. A trade secret for you. Anyway. Let me just say, right off the bat, I'm so honored to be overseeing this expedition. Anything I can do to help you, please let me know. Check you can get out. to the point. You can get to the point faster. All right, locate the magical disturbances. Pretty nice crib, right? Hi. Well, chillax. Interact with the winch by looking at it and pressing E. Wait, I'm just looking at my crib. I mean, it could use a paint job, definitely. Alright. Alright, let's go down. Down to the forest floor. Strong alchemic readings indicate presence of a nearby flora. Ah, yes. The exceedingly obvious glowing plant. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So we need to get... Oh, okay. We need to get up there. Huh. This is awfully quiet. I mean, I hear sounds and everything, but I don't really see any creatures. What's this? Collect. Willow Wisp? What? What's that? Can I. Uh, let's see. Inventory. This is Willow Wisps? Willow Wisps. Glowing balls of pollen found by willow trees. Hmm. Okay. I can help here. Pull and release the left mouse button to direct L pin to a location. Press space to jump. Okay. So he's gonna help us move along. Nice! That's pretty cool! Hey! Hey, was this another thingy to Mother's Rumos? Nice. A very colorful moss. Why does the service analysis have the initials PB on them? Huh. I'm not sure, Edric. Restricted files. Come on, Elpin. Okay, so where do we... Oh, through here, I guess. Let's go up. Up, up, up. Ooh, more moss. More colorful moss. Nice. And whatever this is. Life leaf. Oh, maybe I can make some life potions with that. Okay. Get over there. Nice. Thank you. I'm just gonna pick up every sample. 
I'm just gonna pick up every sample I can get. That's where I have to go, right? Okay. Up. Edric, oh. do you need assistance? I, I do. No, I be quite all right, Hold down the well, marker to. Okay. Yes. Get <laughs> over here. Okay. Let's put him here. Is that too high? No, it's not too high. Good. Hey, hey more moss. More colorful okay. moss. Uh, stay there. Hey. There we go. Hey. Okay. What's up with this plant Edric, here? Look. I Flora Magica. Flora Magica often have enchantments to protect themselves from being destroyed. Much like how a thorn can protect a rose from being picked. Follow purple flora roots to locate glyphs and unlock the barrier. Okay, so we need to have access to this one. Okay, I need to go there. See, that's a glyph right there. Up. Oh, it's done? Oh, well, that was fast. Wait, right, let me get this. Nice. Okay, so that's one down. One glyph down and one somewhere in the back there. Let's go. Let's follow this one. Huh. Okay. It's kind of weird that this thing just... You can use Elpin to help you descend high falls. Alright. Well, there's no high fall around here. From what I'm seeing. Okay. Okay, stay there and... Nice. There we go. Another plant. Yes, we got fern cotton. Uh, no, okay, wait, I don't want you there. Uh, uh, okay. Is that too high? I think that's too high. Okay, that's good. Are you coming? These structures hmm. are an alchemic symbol for door. They probably have a power source. I guess this is the power source. Dispense. Oh. Oh, that's cool. Nice. Hey. Nice. Seems like I might be able to move this. Okay, I did that already. Oh. You mean this thing? Push. Ah, uh, okay. Come on. Go. Whoa! Uh, I didn't... Did I do that? Whoopsie! Uh, okay, dude. Go... Not there. Um... How can I... Follow wait. me, Elfin. Well, how do I go down? Can I go down here without getting hurt? I think I should. Oh, come on! That wasn't that far down. Jesus. Whatever. Huh. Okay, what do we have here? Okay, what do we need here? I need to go down. There's a plant there. And what exactly? Hmm, okay, I need to open this door. Uh, okay, 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 so... Okay. I guess we're gonna go down. Okay. Uh, okay. Let's pick up this. Ah, that's cool. That is pretty... Oh, and there's another one here. Hmm. Come on. Marvelous. So I need to activate this one. Wait. Wait, one second, let's see. So if I take the plan from here, it's gonna... Okay, okay, I got it. Okay. Let's try to block this thing. Come on. Come on. Did it. Come on. See? What the fuck? Jesus. Okay, let's try that. I'm gonna block the door. Okay. 
Let's see if it works. Ah, it worked. Can I crouch? Yes, I can. Ah, it worked. Yes. Uh. Oh, we need to get. Okay. Come on. Come on. This old man can't go for. Okay. He he really can't climb much. Okay, old man. Come on. Uh, uh, okay. Oh, that's too high for him. See. Let me out the way before you open that thing. Nice. Come on, old man. There we go. Uh, come on. Yes. We got it. Yeah, baby, we got it. Another freaking door. Hello. Uh. Okay, you're in my face. You're in my face, Elpin. I'm just gonna get all of these. I'm not sure what you're supposed to do in the full game with these. Maybe you'll be able to make some potions or something. I'm not really sure, but we'll have to see. Okay, well, let's go. Let's put up this one here. Ah, uh, that's too high. Um, that's too low. I can't do it if you're looking. Okay. Uh, that's too. Oh no, it's not. Yes. Hey, we got it. Come on, come on, Elben. Elben. Did the E pin give a name to the floor? Zero zero one two zero zero. No no no. <laughs> Stop there. In the common tongue. English man, English. Betsy. Betsy? No idea how a machine could come up with that. Huh. Nevertheless, Betsy may prove very useful if there are other flora magica out there whose fruits and flowers we may combine with Betsy's into potions. Ah, see potions. And even possibly a cure for the rot. Hey. Ouch. Come on. Oh, I, I got hurt into. Okay, whatever. Uh, come on. Come on, Elpin. Come on, come on, come on. Where is the source of this thing? I'll keep hold of this. What do we have? What the hell is this thing? Hello. Huh? That's cute. Uh. That is very, very cute. Is this something we can pick up? Yes, mithril ore. Hi. Oh. I wonder what you're gonna do with this. Okay, okay, come on. I kind of have the feeling that things are gonna collapse around us. Strange. Mm, you can place I items on top of Elpin. Looks to be the same circumference as your head, Elpin. Hmm. <laughs> oh, okay, I get it now. So I can wait. I can put Elpin here. Drop this. Oh, no, no, no. Sorry, sorry. No, sorry, sorry. Okay. Okay. I can put this here. Okay, okay, I get it. I get it. Hmm. Uh, uh, okay, come. Okay, so it closes. Okay, okay, I got it. Come on, dude. We still haven't found. Oh, what? Hey, yeah. Uh, how the? Oh, um. Where do I do I get that one? Oh, well, what the hell do I get? To put here. Wait, 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 wait. Is there anything else I could take? But... Hmm... But can I go back up there? No, oh, because that's gonna close off. Wait, doesn't make sense. Wait. Dispense. Oh. 
Wait, 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 I don't get it. Oh, no, <laughs> metal. So if I, I go there, then I let that fall, but how do I get it then? Uh, hmm. Wait. Can you come here, dude? Okay. I'm gonna drop this here. Hey! I'm thinking it's another plant here that I don't, I'm not seeing. Oh no, I think I get it. Okay, wait. I'll be able to dispense from there, I think. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay, I got it now. I think I got it. Okay, you stay here. You might need a hand. Oh, sorry. No, no, no. Not that. Sorry. Sorry. Okay. Let's try this again. Let's see that again. Because that's a dispenser, that thing right there, it's a dispenser of these these flowers. So I can just take it from there, I think. Uh, okay. Okay. And then... Uh, yeah, spawn keys from dispenser plant. See? Got it. Okay, I got it again. Nice. <laughs> All right. All right. I may be old, but I can still think a little bit. Oh, what the hell is going on here? Water? Huh. Oh, and left. Okay. Kawabanga! <laughs> nice. I got a plant and. Whew. Hey. Phew. Wow. This was really deep. Find us a way out. Hello. The only possible exit point is up. Wait, why is the water going? Uh oh. This. <laughs> oh. Ah, oh, it worked. Goodness. Hello. That was close. That was close. It seems whatever happened in that cave has set off a reaction. I'm detecting a distinct lack of barrier around the nearby flora. Nice. Barrier. Nice, we can get that freaking thing now. Okay, uh, get over here. Okay, come on. And over here. Up, up, up. Can only go up from here. Up, up, up. Um. Okay. Oh, what the hell? What's with the? Uh... Ow! What the fuck? Oh, what? Oh, come on! Press R to initiate registration mode. What the hell? That's crap. Jesus. Platform umbrella thing for me here. Jesus. So these things keep on falling now? Jesus. Okay. Don't. Ah, oh, no, come on! Oh, Jesus Christ. Uh, what? Whatever. Okay. Okay, okay. Okay. Jesus, I'm gonna wait until this one falls. No, no. Oh no, not there. Don't go there. Don't be stupid. Stupid Cupid, stop picking on me. Oh, come on, dude. <laughs> That's so stupid. Ah, oh, Jesus Christ. Okay. Oh shit! I just told it to that. That was that, that. That was totally my fault. I can help here. Okay, relax, Jesus. Okay. 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 I just need to go. Oh, 
Come on. Okay. There we go. Jesus. Where the hell do those things... Oh, come on. They just spawn out of nowhere. Are you kidding me right now? Let me see. I think they spawn out of nowhere. Come on. Eh, oh, come on. That's stupid. Okay, never mind. But uh, that is dumb. Come on, let's get a plant. Collect. Bring the ingredients to the lab. Alright. The bowl is conjured by the plant to protect itself. A remarkably sophisticated defense mechanism. And dive! Oh come on! That didn't work. Okay, dive. Hey, it worked! We didn't die. <laughs> we didn't actually die, okay. Bring the ingredients to the lab. Alright, collect the... Collect the... Bubblet Brew. As a final challenge, see if you can use the new potion to find and collect the Jubilees and Dangleberries hidden in the forest. Okay, so uh, everyone, that was pretty much the... The demo version, that's uh, that the public demo version of Project Grove. Uh, there's an extended version that you can actually play if... Uh, uh, <laughs> if uh, you pledge on... Uh, where's the thingy? Oh, there. Uh, nice. <laughs> so you don't get hurt anymore because of this potion. So there's another version, um, an extended version that uh, you can get if you pledge on Kickstarter. Right now the Kickstarter campaign is uh, is running. It's um, it aims to okay. It aims to raise. Uh, let me see, twenty nine thousand and two hundred uh, pounds, British pounds, and uh, you know you can give as little as uh, as uh, one pound. To unlock the extended uh, extended demo, or of course you can give more if you'd like to, you know, get a copy. Um, at least a pledge of fifteen pounds, which is about twenty dollars, will get you a copy. And uh, you know, there's you know higher tiers with more stuff. I know there's a sixty pound tier that would get you. Oh, nice. Uh, that's uh, gonna get you access to. Come on! Oh, fuck off. Jesus. Ouch. Okay. That that hurts. Uh, okay, let me kill myself. <laughs> uh, there's a 60 uh, pound pledge for... Um, if you want to get more... Uh, oh, there's another... No, there's, there's one here. Okay. Uh, if you want access to a release before everyone else. But, you know, um, even if you don't get that, the game should be out. Um, in August 2020 if everything goes to plan. So yeah, everyone that was a uh, Project Grove check it out on Kickstarter to the link in the description below. This demo version is available on itch.io and on Steam. Also links in the description to all that. Thanks so much everyone for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up real quick. And if you like what I do here, consider subscribing. That would be actually immensely, immensely helpful if you could subscribe. Tell other people about the channel, spread the word, check out the back catalog too. Uh, oh, come on. <laughs> I'm on YouTube, I'm on BitChute, I'm on DTube, so whichever platform you prefer, go there, subscribe, check out the back catalog. I would definitely recommend you try um, at least uh, subscribing to YouTube and BitChute because those are the two platforms where I uh, do most of uh, the content. I have, you know, I do live streams and developer interviews on uh, YouTube because I do those, you know, live. Um, and I also put up more gameplay videos on BitChute. Uh, most gameplay videos are going to be on all platforms, but uh, I do have BitChute exclusives, so uh, check those out to the links in the description. Thanks so much again, everyone. Uh, if you want to support me, you can do that by using uh, the links... Oh, sorry, uh, using the ways uh, described 
uh, just below. Uh, you can either give me a direct donation through PayPal or you can support me with the purchases that you make. Come on, why doesn't he go up? That's so weird. <laughs> you can uh, support me with the purchases that you make on the Epic Games Store, the Humble Store, Fanatical. All you have to do in those cases is either use an affiliate link or a creator tag. It costs you absolutely nothing extra. You don't pay more for the stuff that you buy. You just tell that store to send me a small percentage of the money you spend there. So it's a very small thing that you can do. But it goes a very, very long way. Uh, last but not least, another way to help out, you can download and try out the Brave Browser. Now, the Brave Browser is an open source, privacy focused browser that's based on Chromium. Well, wow, I can't make that jump anymore. Um, it's a browser that uh, is more respectful of your privacy, it has a built in ad blocker, it blocks trackers. It's really cool. I've been using it for more than a year now, and it's become my daily driver. Uh, so, check it out, download it to the referral link in the description install it if you end up using it for a month then i will get a small crypto reward now if you already use a ray browser you can tip me on any video of mine on youtube or on any post that i make on twitter at cryptic hybrid you, uh, you can tip me basic attention tokens thanks again everyone for watching this has been project growth and until the next time we see each other thank you and have an awesome day